I recently got a question from a viewer who had set up to use VLOOKUP in their spreadsheet, and instead of the desired result in the cell, the cell was displaying the VLOOKUP formula itself. So if this has ever happened to you, whether it's the VLOOKUP formula or any other formula that's displaying in the cell instead of your desired result from that formula, there are a couple of things that you can check on to troubleshoot and fix this. I'm going to show you how to do that in this video. Let's take a look. All right, first let's take a look at the issue. Here we have a spreadsheet where we have column E where we want to pull in the name of the manager on this employee database, and we're using VLOOKUP to do that. But you can see that the VLOOKUP formula is showing instead of the result. So the first thing I'm going to check is to make sure that I don't have the spreadsheet set up to show formulas. So to do that, all I have to do is come up to formulas, and under the formula auditing area, there's a button called show formulas. Make sure that is not checked. In this case, it's checked, so I'm going to click it to uncheck it. Now that fixes most of my issues, but I still have a few issues here. Uh, the second thing I'm going to look at is to make sure that the cell is not formatted as text. So notice that these cells that are working properly, they, they are showing the desired result. They're pulling the name of the manager into that column. That's great. If I right click and I say format cells, I can see that these are formatted as a general format. I'm going to click OK, but notice up here where I have an issue or an, the formula still showing, I'm going to right click and I'm going to format cells and this is formatted as text. So I'm going to go ahead and change that to general and click OK. Now I'm going to come up here, place my cursor up here in the field box and hit enter and that fixes the issue. So just make sure that you don't have all of the cells in a certain column formatted as text if your formulas are showing. Now I have one last formula showing down here, and in this case what I'm going to look at is in case I've typed out the syntax of the VLOOKUP formula, um, in this case I forgot to put an equals at the beginning. So I'm going to go ahead and hit equals up here, put my cursor at the end and hit enter, and then that fixes that issue. Um, sometimes if I'm working fast I might type out the syntax of a formula and not put the equals sign so then Excel doesn't recognize that in fact it is a formula. So those are are three things that you can troubleshoot to check on in case you're seeing your formula in your cell instead of the desired result. Don't forget to share this video with your friends and colleagues. And I wanted to let you know about the thanks button below this video. That's the super thanks button from YouTube. And if you click on that, you can actually make a donation to this channel. Any contribution you make goes directly towards creating more content and videos like this for my channel. I really appreciate all the support from all of my viewers. Thank you so much. If you found this video helpful, be sure and give it a thumbs up to like it. You can subscribe to my channel and click the bell to receive a notification every time I post a new video. Be sure and visit my website, SharonSmithHR.com. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you next time.